I want to tell you that this is your hour. Amen. I want you to hear me carefully. This is your hour. Amen. I thought I would see some fire and amens. Amen, Hallelujah. amen, amen. This is your hour. This is your hour. This is your time. This is your hour and this is your time. This is your hour and this is your time. I want you to be not only excited, but I want you to rejoice in the Lord because this is your prophetic hour. It is your time of prayer and solution. So let somebody know that will let somebody know because we are going to do something that uh, is going to be very, very powerful uh, tonight. By the help of the Holy Spirit, our lives must change. You know, there are times when you come before God. It's just a good time to come before God. But there are hours you come before God and your life transforms. Amen. This is one of those hours. This is one of those times that something in you needs to shift and change. Amen. It is the absolute will of God for you to completely be transformed and be changed. I want somebody to go to Philippians chapter 4, verse 6 to 7. I don't want to stay too long. I want us to go quickly and just uh, and, 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 uh, and get into this. Philippians chapter 4, verse 6 to 7. Uh-huh. Uh huh. Be by prayer and supplication uh -huh. with thanksgiving. Let your requests be made known unto God. Uh huh. And the peace of God, which passeth all understanding, shall keep your hearts and minds through Christ Jesus. Now I want you to read it one more time, but I want you to move closer because I'm not hearing you well. So I need you to move close. Don't sit too far so I can hear you. I want you to get this Philippians. Uh, chapter 4 verse 6 to 7 is too much. It's too much. I want you to hear this and I will explain to you what God is saying to us. Philippians chapter 4 verse 6 to 7. Mm -hmm. Be careful for nothing. The word careful simply means don't worry for anything. Amen. You see, there are reasons why you worry. You worry because you don't pray. And if you pray, you pray the long, wrong way because you don't understand the principles and the mechanics of prayer. Some people ask, why is it that when I pray, uh, God is not answering me? There is, a, there is a specific instruction that is in Philippians chapter 4, verse 6 to 7, that is powerful. Number one, you worry because you don't pray and you don't pray because you worry. Mm, wow, that's really, really good. If somebody comes before God with worries, you are testifying that you cannot receive everything, anything from God. Mm. Remember, if God is your refuge, you run to God for help. You don't run to God because your worries are overwhelming you, but you run to God to relieve you from your worries. Amen, amen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I want you to hear me well. Many pray, but they pray the wrong way. Yeah. Because they don't understand how this thing works. I want you to share this. Keep letting people know that prophet is life. Amen. I want you to hear this and hear me well. Be careful for nothing. Meaning, don't worry about anything. Whenever there is a problem, go to your father. You see, when you understand that God is your father, yeah. there is a way you approach God. You approach God with confidence that you know that he can do something. You see, faith is also confidence. Yes. Mm. Yes. Faith is confidence. Faith is not just I know that it is possible because that means you're believing. You see, belief doesn't have confidence of right now. I want you to hear me. Believing says it is possible, but not necessarily right now. Confidence says I can make it happen right now. That is faith. Faith produces confidence. Believing has room for doubt because it may happen now or not now, but I know that it is possible. You see, there's a lot of Christians that believe in God, but they don't believe God right now. And to believe God right now, you need faith. And faith brings confidence in a person. You see, like when I'm operating prophetically and you don't know me, you think I'm a very prideful person. You may think that I am aggressive, but it's not that. There is a certain confidence. There is something that happens within your spirit. And when it happens within your spirit, you can face a lion and slap a lion and say, you quiet, pussycat, and he will be quiet. There is energy that is, I feel like I'm talking to myself. 
There is energy that is produced within you that you begin to, ab you begin to behave abnormally. Not the way regular people would operate. You start, there is an aggression that comes into you. And that aggression is not that you are forcing something. The aggression is, why was I in that situation for so long and God is able to do it? Amen. Amen. So capture this by the Spirit of God. Faith produces confidence. A confident person is not a worried person. Because a confident person is sure. You see, faith makes you certain. Yes. Faith makes you sure. Yes. Believing is not certain. So already if you are praying and you have no confidence in God, you have already failed. That is why the Bible says, whoever will come to God must know that he is. Yeah, amen. What is he? Is the question. Whoever comes to God must know that he is. He is what? He is able to heal me. He is able to change me. He is able to answer my prayer. He is able to heal me. He is able to heal me from cancer. He is able to open doors. He's Listen, there is a confidence that comes with faith. When you look at people seeing miracles today, and I, you know, the thing that makes me laugh is this. I haven't even begun doing what God wants me to do. Wow. 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 I'm just scratching the surface. But you'll see already a lot of people are confused. Yes. I believe God can do it, but is this real? Are people acting? Is this this? The reason why people are like that, they believe God, but they have no faith in God. Faith says God can do it. What is impossible about this? What is impossible with man is possible with God. Faith says that. Yes. Believing says, you know, God can do it, but maybe they are faking it. You are still in believing. You have not entered faith. Come on. Mm. People who are in believing say, God, if you want, heal me. Yeah. People who are confident, they say, God, you heal me now. Amen. Is somebody there? If you can hear me, just, just um, type some fire. I want to see some fire and know that you are, you are listening to me. Hmm. Uncle Max, I want you to read that again to me. Read that again with extra boldness. Can you refresh the page for me? A little bit. It's just a little bit behind. Uh, read it for me. Philippians chapter 4, verse uh -huh. 6. Uh -huh. Be careful for nothing, uh -huh. but in everything, by prayer and supplication, uh -huh. with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God. Now listen to this. I want you to, to listen to this. There is a difference between prayer and supplication. Mm -hmm. There are two forms of prayer, but they are not the same prayer. Mm. There is a difference between prayer and supplication prayer mm. or the prayer of supplication. Okay. Prayer is simply communicating with God. Mm -hmm. Supplication is when you have an appointment with God and you have all your documents ready why you are justified to get what you want to get. Wow, that's really good. Wow. That is the difference between prayer and supplication. So the Bible is telling you don't worry for anything, but with everything, bring prayer and your supplication before God with thanksgiving. Why is thanksgiving not missing? You're already saying thank you because you know that you're about to get what you want. Prayer is simply, Father, I love you. Lord, you know my heart. Father, you know what is going on with me. Father, do something. Supplication is Mark chapter 16, verse 17 to 18 says, And this sign shall follow them that believe. Father, I want to see the signs that are written here. That is supplication. I, I don't know if somebody is listening to me. Some of you quote scriptures in prayer, yet you are supposed to quote scriptures in supplication. Mm. Uh, I feel like I'm. That's I feel like I'm talking on my own here. You're teaching. You're teaching. I want more people to share this. Share this. Let somebody know that the prophet is live. Let somebody know that the prophet is live. I want you to be aware. I want you to be alert. Type. Type to your neighbor. Neighbor, be alert. Uh, this one in this room itself is dead. Somebody type online, do better than the people that are in here. Say, neighbor, be alert. Neighbor, be alert. I want you to type that with confidence. Neighbor, be alert. Neighbor, Neighbor be, be alert. alert. So you have to understand this by the Spirit of God. Listen to me. You need to capture this by the Spirit of God.
There is something called Tashuva grace or the now grace. When you understand the hour, the moment, there is something you can pull from it. There is something that you can extract from it. This is that hour. Amen. This is that hour. Amen. This is that time. I wish somebody could hear me by the Spirit of God. This is that hour. Amen. That now God has revealed to you that don't just pray. If you have problems, bring supplication. Amen. The blessing of God, the grace of God, the healing of God, the transformation of God has nothing to do with you, has everything to do with him. Mm. Why did the children of Israel receive bread when they were disobedient in the, in the wilderness? They understood that God was responsible for them, not Moses. They said, Moses, tell your God we want bread. Right. Yeah. Mm. God was actually upset. He said, what? Uh -huh. Uh -huh. They are challenging me, but tell them every morning there will be bread. Notice, when you understand that it is a king you're dealing with, his decree that he said, he has to make it happen. Yes. 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 It's pa powerful. Amen. Are you guys here? Yes. yes. What has the king said concerning you? Rabba shandele beku rabasaya. Lebron de Beliki da Latusia, Le Cron de Balacatica da Basante, Rambo Leke diga da Bashaya, Zendro Teki da Balatush. What has God said about you? That you have taken him by your. You know, when people say take God by his word, people just think it is believing on scripture. No. Listen to what the Bible says My word shall not return unto me void, but it shall accomplish what he was set out to do. It means when the word of God comes to you, you need to take it back to him. Yes. Because it is when you return the word that it manifests what it's supposed to do. Yes. Uh, is somebody listening? Listen. We're listening. Stop having a Christianity that is lukewarm. Yes. That is waiting for God to do something. Yet the Bible says God has given you everything pertaining to life and unto what? Godliness. Yes. God has given you everything pertaining to life and what? Godliness. God has given you everything. There is nothing that God has held back from you. Some of you are driving by your own house that God has prepared for you. Somebody else is living in it. And you're saying, wow, one day. One day. Yet the Bible says, ye shall have homes. Wherever the foot, your, the sole of your feet shall tread upon, it is yours. But listen to this carefully. You are still wishful thinking. Mm. Daydreaming. Uh, will it not be nice? Will it not be so amazing? Will it not be precious? If I can just get to where God wants me to get to. If I can just elevate to another level. God is looking at you saying, ah, did I die so that you can wish? Or did I die so that you can have it? When you pray, Jesus said, I will answer. So I don't need to do anything. He already did everything. I just need to be in a position to receive. What you're missing is the ability to receive. And the reason why you cannot receive is because you don't know the difference between prayer and supplication. You don't understand the difference between faith and believing. The only work, they asked Jesus, what is the work of a child of God? He said, to believe in the one that the Lord sent. Do you believe in Jesus whom the Father sent? That is the question. You say, yes, I receive him, I know, but do you have faith in him? Do you know that Jesus suffered every sickness you can think of on the cross? The Bible says, by his stripes we are healed. Amen. So if we are sick, then it's because we don't know something. Yeah. It's not that God is not able. Amen. 
So you should not be in pain. Pain was not yours to carry, it is his. That is why the Holy Spirit is a comforter. What he cannot deliver you from, he will comfort you through. There are things that it is not in God's will to deliver you, but it's to comfort you through it because there is something to learn. Amen. Amen. But tonight, listen to me carefully. There is a dynamic shift that is about to take place. Amen. There is a dynamic shift that is about to take place. Yes. There is about to be a celestial visitation to each and every one of you that is watching. Amen. 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 A glorious and a mighty visitation that all of you are about to witness. Amen. Amen. Hallelujah. The question is, do you understand? Do you comprehend? Do you comprehend how to supplicate? Does it make sense to you how to give or to bring your supplications before God? How do you do it? How do you bring supplications before God? Because you notice your answers to prayer is not simply by asking. Listen to what the Bible says in Isaiah. Before they pray, I will answer. While they are still speaking, I will hear. So God answers your prayer. When you say, Father, this situation has been stagnant. He says, okay, no problem. I'm ready to hear you now. Where's this application? Yes. Prayer is a means of communicating that which you spoke. Yes. You should say that one more time, please. Prayer is simply a way of recommunicating what he has said. John chapter 16 verse 24. Here is one of the supplications. Why you need to add this in your prayer. Auntie Rose is with this. John 16 24. Mm -hmm. Amen. Hitherto have ye asked nothing in my name. Ask and you shall receive that your joy may be full. So God is interested to answer you so that your joy may be full. So Amen. God doesn't want to give you things that will not bring joy. Amen. That's so good. Some of you, you want things that will give you happiness. God doesn't want you to be happy. He wants you to have joy. Amen. Amen. Happiness is temporary. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It flows with circumstances. But joy is consistent. Yes. Yes. Come rain, come sunshine, God will carry you through because you are consistent in joy. Because joy is not external, it is internal. So what will God do for you that will provoke joy? Amen. That will make your joy run over? Amen. Amen. Uh, somebody is not listening to me. That's good. It means joy must be in eternal purposes. Not in temporary things. God, I just want a car. Next week, they will come out with a new car. You want another car. Yeah. That is happiness. Yeah. God doesn't mind giving you that, but God wants you to have joy. Yeah. Joy means that you are always in season. Amen. Amen. When you tap into joy, you say, Lord, when you make me a billionaire, I will be so glad to see how many people will come to Jesus. Yes. I will be so glad to build so many orphanages. Yes. That children will have such a purpose and a future. And they will know that you are God. You see now, you are not looking for self. You see, happiness has to do with self. Yes. I just want to be happy. I just want to be happy. But giving brings joy. Mm. Yes. Because it's not about what you receive physically. It's about what happens within you. So there is a dimension, ribando le bahida, la casto velikida, 
Regos de veliga malatosh. Rande gelebe sutala brande kila arudia masata baya. Rope ledia alida 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 masota. There are things you can do. You provoke something else in the spirit. Mm. Don't be a human being that is temporary. It doesn't pay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's true. That's true. It doesn't pay. Are you guys listening to me? Yeah. Yes. It does not pay. It does not pay. But eternal things pay. Eternal things elevate. Amen. Eternal things transform. Yes. I want you to keep sharing and keep sharing. We are about to get into prayer. Yes. We are about to get into intense prayer. We are about to go somewhere dangerous. Amen. So the number one thing you should know that God is concerned about your joy. Amen. Where is your joy meter? <laughs> you see some people when they hear the word of God or they're in church, they respond according to happiness, not according to joy. You, jo you know joy gives you excitement like a baby. You can't wait. You can't wait. You don't know why, but you can't even get enough sleep yeah. because there is fire within you that you just can't, there is an excitement yes. right, right, yes. Right. that you just wait for a reaction so that your joy can burst. You know, when you carry joy and you laugh, people will think you are crazy. <laughs> when you carry joy and somebody says something that touches, the way you rejoice is shocking. Joy makes you like a child that is anticipating what his father going to do next. Yeah. Mm. Happiness is about you, not about your father. Mm. Happiness is about what they can do for me. Wow. Wow. What I can do for me. Joy is what can God, what is the ability of God? What has God done? Yeah. So ask yourself right now, where is your joy meter? Some of you, your joy meter is at zero. Some of you, it's at 10%. There are some that is it, it's at 70, at 80, but God wants your joy to go beyond 100. He wants it to overflow. Mm. That's deep. You can't kill somebody that has joy. Satan does not go after people who have joy. Wow. Mm. Some of you people have become your joy. Mm. Wow. But it's not really joy, it's happiness. Wow. Your love for people is more than what God has given for you. Your attention for God is less than, I feel like I'm talking to myself. Mm. You're teaching, you're teaching good. Your joy must be full. Your joy must be full. Your joy. Your joy must be full. Your joy must be full. Your joy must be full. Take one scripture right now. Just lay it down. God desired that my joy is full. Which area of my life will produce joy? So when you do your supplication, you are in the spirit. You are in the thoughts and the mind of God and how God is seeing things. A person of joy is unkillable. Amen. Is indestructible. Amen. Amen. Because Satan knows, even if I take their car, take their wife, their husband, these people are not changing, leave them alone. People of happiness, Satan can mess with you every second because he knows you're you're carnal. Wow. Mm. 
But somebody with joy, whether you are betrayed, it doesn't matter. You say human beings are are unfaithful anyway. It is God that is faithful. If they turn against you, say everybody can turn against me, but my God will never turn against me. Mm. A person with joy is indestructible. A person with joy is unkillable. And joy makes your faith become easy. When your joy meter is high, faith is easy. Mm. When your joy is high, faith is easy. Are you ready for a shift to happen to your life today? Are you ready for there to be a shift? Joy puts freedom in you. You walk, you feel like you look at the grass, it looks extra green. You look at a difficult situation, you see a way where nobody is seeing ways. Somebody type, I am ready for joy. I'm ready for joy. I can't hear you. Type, I am ready for joy. I am ready for joy. I want you to type, I am ready for joy. I am ready for joy. Somebody just type, get ready for prayer. Some of you need to, if it's late where you are, you need to stand up to pray. Yes. If Don't be comfortable. We are about to intensely pray. Amen. If it was up to me, I would not even minister sitting down. I would stand up. I don't even know if that's possible, Auntie Rose. Or do we have to shift everything? Will we have to change everything? I don't want to, I don't want to uh, pray while standing up. I want you to be ready to pray. Rabalaba shandalaba kataya. Redebe sunda la baraki da atulabaya. Zebrediga aluda balasata. Pasala bashaya. I feel the unction for prayer. 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 Thank you, Lord Jesus. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Psalms 89, verse 20. Psalms 89, verse 20 to 21. Psalms 89, verse 20. Verse 20, to 21, tw- verse 20 to 21. Quickly, if you have it, type I have it before, uh, um, before we read. If you have it, grab it quickly. Say, I have it before we read. Type, I have it, I am ready, I have it, I have it, I am ready, and then we'll begin. Thank you, Jesus. Grab your anointing oil wherever it is. If you don't have anointing oil, tomorrow buy some olive oil consecrate it, and then use it, say from today, Father, this will be my prayer oil. You pray for it and you put it aside. Don't use it for cooking. (laughs) Put it somewhere else. Strictly for prayer. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Glory be to God. Are we ready? Everybody says they have it. Psalms 89, verse 20 to 21. Can we read it? You can use any anointing oil you have. Some people are asking if they can use the, the, the roe oil. Absolutely you can. Are you ready? Psalms 89, 20 to 21. Uh-huh, read. I have found David, my servant. Mm-hmm. With my holy oil have I anointed him. Uh-huh. With whom my hand shall be established. Mine arm also shall strengthen him. Now listen to this. You're going to take that oil. You're going to read it one more time. And then you're going to anoint yourself and say, Father, today by this anointing oil, establish me. Because this is you. You are the one who anointed me. You are the one who chose me. By your mighty hand, establish me. So that your will will be established on earth. Open your mouth and begin to pray. Establishment of the Spirit. Establishment of the Spirit. Rikadosha. Rando Baliga Balatea. Reconze Ziga Dabadush. Riton Tekita Latuta. Repopo Paladiga Labadosha. 
Kabadosh, Reka Baladi Gadabasaya, Repele Besuta, establish me by your anointing, establish me by your power, establish me by your strength, Riko Paliga, Rekonde Le Gidaba, Zekonde Le Bidaba, Repa Ladusia, Zeko Paladi, Rineme Sote, Liko Rebadila Ato, Paradio, 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 Iko La Masita La Barate, Paradio, Zikote Le Paradio, Zikote Paradio, Zikote Paradio, Izola Mandili Biata, Ripaladia Adoraba Sita, Repete Le Besuta, Rapapa, Repaladusia, I am established, my family is established, by the mighty hand of God, I am established, I am established, make that declaration, I am established by the hand of God, I am established by the hand of God, Rikala Basota, Erababa Santa, Rebede Besuta la Brade Kida, Repala Duria Masete, Ribonde Kida la Dosh, Ricata la Baseta, Rica Mandolia Savo, Rimandole Basataya, Ricate le Besita, Rebonde, 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 Kiria Basota, Zadaba la Basita, Rimandole Becara la Sata la Bayata, Rebo, 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 Rebo. Rebo, 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 Zakida Basanta, Rebe de Besuta, Imo Nema Suta Paligata, I am established, my, I am established. Begin to establish your career. Begin to establish your children. Begin to establish your finances. Declare it by the Spirit of God. I am established by the, man, my, the hand of God. My businesses, my children, my families. Declare these words now. Rekabala basute, rigonde barika talayata, zepo zepo zepo, rekata la masita la baso, rovia masete, roviva viva viva lima tosh, viva 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 lima tosh, rigonde rigonde rigonde, le bambangende gende gezu, zingonge ngandinga dus, rengandunga bendengiza, reng. Gandunge rebe sente. Ribandele be rebe de be suta. Rango ziga. Rango ziga. Zekere be sandile bakura. Rabadabayata. Zake de be suta. Ribaladila masote. Rigos de valiga balados. Rabalaba sote le bahando. Rebalaba sita. Rako satila masete. Rigalaba sandele be kora basata. Rebo bo 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 satia. Your business is established. Your family is established. Everything you do is going to be established beginning now. In the name of Jesus. Are you still here? If you're here, type fire. Say, I am here. I want you to be prayerful. I don't want you to play around with this hour. I don't want you to play around with this hour. Oh, Jesus. E kalabasonta. E kalabasote. Thank you, Lord Jesus. Listen to me now. Some people are arguing why is he speaking in tongues. Please, if you're demon-possessed, leave this place. Amen. I'm giving you prayer points. It tells you that you know what I'm praying about. Yes. Listen to me. Pay attention. Don't be distracted. Listen to this and listen to this by the Spirit of God. You are going to pray now that, Lord, let my joy be full according to your word. Let my joy be full according to your word. You are going to bring up the prayer requests that you have. The prayer requests that you have, you bring it before God. And you're going to say, Father, let my joy be full. When it comes to my family, let my joy be full. When it comes to my children, let my joy be full. When it comes to my marriage, let my joy be full. I want your eternal purpose. I want your eternal purposes. I don't want my will. I don't want my thoughts. I want your eternal purposes. Is, does everybody understand this? Yes. Does everybody understand this? 
Does everybody understand this? Yes. Open your mouth, begin to pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, may our joy be full. May our joy be full. Regardless of any area of our life, we desire your eternal purpose. When it comes to our financial life, when it comes to our family life, when it comes to our ministries, when it comes to our ministrations, when it comes to every area of our life, we desire your eternal purpose. We desire your eternal purpose purpose. May no our joy be full. May my joy be full. May my joy be full. May my joy be full. As I see your people being healed, when I look at your people being delivered, Father, may my joy be full. Father, you know my heart. That is what I desire is to see your people transformed, is to see your people elevated. This is why you created me. This is why you sent me. This is why you anointed me. Father, let me see. Let me see the fruits of my labor. Let me see the fruits of my labor. May my joy be full when I see they can prophesy. May my joy be full when I see their marriages reconciled. May my joy be full when I see their doors open. In the name of Jesus. Rekalaba sandele bekura, rada ba 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 suta, rekalaba sandele bekarata, rigadoli ama sote, rebede be suta la barata, rikalama sante, rapa la kita la barot, rikato la basitia, remanduri ama seta, rekondele kida la basote, rapa la katia, rakata la batia, rakala batia, rakala batia, rakala batia. Zekola basiki di biaba, romandele be sota, rekada la basente, reba ba 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 sandi di biaba, rekoda la basita, rebo ba 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 dia, zekala ba da basante, rakudi amasete, repa la tua, zako zako, zekole ba duli amasete, rekote le be do, zekola basita, zakoli amasente. Zita la masete, zika la masete, roba liba lebe suta la barata, rekaba la basente lebe rote, zakora masiti ya masete, rika da la basata, overflowing joy, overflowing joy, overflowing joy, overflowing joy, overflowing joy, overflowing joy, reka la basata ya, reka da le ma, reka la basata. Masota, rekala masota, rekala masota, rekala masota, eda la masote le mahande, rekala basata la baya, rekala basata la baya, ei zakuba la basante, rota la makidi ya masata, roka la basete, where there have not been fulfillment in my life, where there has not been fulfillment in my life, open your mouth and pray. Say wherever there has not been fulfillment, may joy fill you. May joy fill you. In Jesus' name, the Holy Spirit just ministered to me. He said, tell them to declare and to pray. You see, in the areas that you're not fulfilled is because there is no joy. Some of you, you are in the places that God has called you to be. I, can you hear me? Are you sure you can hear me? Some of you, you are in areas of your life that God has called you to be. But there is no fulfillment. There is no fulfillment because of one thing. There is a lack of joy. Joy shows that you can see the future. Sometimes you may be in a place that God has called you, but you don't see the future. But joy opens your eyes. Amen. Joy opens your eyes. Joy opens your eyes to see the eternal purposes of God. You are going to declare, my father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I want you to be present. 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 Do you have the mics? Do you have the mics? Hallelujah. Reba Sante Lebeka. Where are the other ones? Le Parabasita. Are you ready? Are you listening? Are you here? My father, my father. My father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In every area of my life. In every area of my life. Where eternal purposes are not being fulfilled. Where eternal purposes are not being fulfilled. Where my joy is low. Where my joy is low. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus.
Jesus. Let there be overflowing joy now. 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 In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Overflowing joy now. Overflowing joy now. Overflowing joy now. Overflowing joy now. Open your mouth. Begin to pray. Overflow, overflow of joy, 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 Le paradus, ze kron de liga aluba, ze kalamasita, ropa diga 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 diga, ze kalos, re kalaba baba baba shante, ze kon de gida angilia asova, izo le bados, ra kon de liga atuba, re pa tulia azota, ze kalamandia ados. Ropale ka atika 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 Zokote la gidi ya asete Rekala basita la badosh Rekoda la basanta Repapa patika delegos In the name of Jesus In the name of Jesus Overflowing joy Overflowing joy Ropa Papa ate de beso Zikloge 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 Maliga Dosha Zepronde Liga Aluki Amasete Zatala Makiri Amasote Reba Baba Baba Siti Amadosh Masubea Masubea Reba Baba Siti Amadosh Le kronge di sa iga do dasa Era baba baba sote In Jesus name Now listen to me and listen to me carefully I want you to hear me by the spirit of God Are you sure you are here? If you can hear me type I am here prophet I am here servant of God I am here man of God If you are here type I am here I am here Oh, Jesus. Oh, I feel it today. Amen, amen. I feel it right now. Amen. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Now, I want you to hear me by the Spirit of God. Amen. You are going to say, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Let every spiritual contention I've been going through. Let, Let every, every spiritual, spiritual contention, contention that I've been, I've been going, going through. through. You have to understand what contention is. Contention means you are always consistently being challenged. Yeah. Mm. Come on. Some of you, you are living a life of challenges. Come on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every time you move forward, there is somebody challenging you. Every time you want to be promoted, there is something challenging you. Yes. Every time your life should shift, there is something battling you. Yes. This ought not to be. Amen. Amen. This ought not to be. Yes. It is absolutely not the will of God. You see, the will of God is for you to enter into his rest. Amen. Amen. The will of God is for you to enter into his rest. Amen. So if you have not entered into his rest, something is amiss. Something is amiss. Say, my father, my father. My, my father, father, my father. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Every 
spiritual contention in my life. Every, every spiritual, spiritual contention, contention in my life. Every spiritual challenges in my life. Every spiritual challenges in my life. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. I silence those demons. I silence those demons. I silence those spirits. I silence those spirits. I silence those challenges. I silence those challenges. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, begin to scatter them, begin to scatter them. Open your mouth, open your mouth, begin to, begin to pray, begin to pray. Fire, fire in the name of Jesus. Fire upon every demon. 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 In the name of Jesus. Fire upon every demon. Fire upon every demon. Fire upon every demon. In the name of Jesus. Re palabashata. Re kalabashata. Re kalabashata. Re kalabashata. Re kalabashata. Re kalabashata. Ro paliga le basate. E rabasata la bakarabasata. Re kalabashata la basata. In the name of Jesus. 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 Loba Baba City Amako. Repele Gudea Antelegosa. Repali Gadosha Lega Televasuta. Rebo Bobo Sate. Rango Lega Dushia Masete. Fire in the name of Jesus. in Jesus name in Jesus name you are going to pray now if you're here still type I am here prophet I am here I am awake I am alive. I am here I am here I am here I am here I'm awake glory be to God I know some places some places right now it's extremely late and some places is early I know in the East Coast is probably uh, 2 a.m. In LA, it's about to be midnight in one hour. I, in some places in Africa, people are just waking up. You can close it and completely open it. Now, I want you to pay attention to what I'm about to tell you. Listen to me carefully. We are going to dissolve every demonic covenant. Some of you, your progression is because there are covenants that are speaking against you. Wow. Mm. Are, are you sure you are here, yeah, people? We're here. we're here. Some of you, your battles is because there are covenants in place that are challenging your life. Mm -hmm. mm. Some of you, there are covenants that are challenging your life. Wow. Yes, but the good news is this. Somebody say there is good news. There is good news. Somebody say there is good news. There is good news. Somebody shout there is good news. There is good news. The good news is this, is that the blood of Jesus was shed so that every satanic covenant may be broken. Amen. 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 The blood of Jesus was shed so that every spiritual attachment that is demonic should be dissolved, Amen. should be destroyed, Amen. should be nullified because of the blood of Jesus. Amen. 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 You see, it's not about pleading the blood. It is about nullifying things because of the blood. 
Amen. Amen. You are going to open your mouth and say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, Father in the, the name, name of, of Jesus. Jesus. Say it with everything that is in you. Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in, in the, the name, name of, of Jesus. Jesus. By reason of the blood of Jesus. By reason of, of the, the blood, blood of Jesus. Jesus. Let every satanic covenant. Let every satanic covenant. Let every demonic attachments. Let, let every, every demonic, demonic attachment. Let every demonic covenant. Let, let every, every demonic covenant. covenant. Let every demonic union. Let, let every, every demonic, demonic union. union. By reason of the blood of Jesus. By reason of the blood of Jesus. Let it lose its power. Let it lose its power. Let it be nullified. Let it be nullified. Let it be cancelled. Let it be cancelled. Let it be dissolved. Let it be dissolved. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Family ties. Family ties. That are demonic. That are demonic. Marital ties. Marital ties. That are demonic. That are demonic. Employment ties. Employment ties. That are demonic that are demonic by the blood of Jesus by the blood of Jesus let them be dissolved let them be dissolved let them be cancelled let them be cancelled open your mouth and begin to pray lift up your voice lift up your voice lift up your voice lift up your voice lift up your voice, lift up your voice. Lift up your voice, lift up your voice. Lift up your voice, lift up your voice. Lebron de Gida Atu. Zikilia Masote. Lord Rebia Aduva. Zekla Godeva Sitaya. Lebron de Gida Atu. Repa Papa, be dissolved in Jesus' name. Castellacho, Baroque, Lop, let it be dissolved. Let it be dissolved. Zekalava Shitia Masote, Luma 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 Leba, 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 Oh, Zeba de Gida, Akoleka de Gadus, Nekia, in Jesus' name. Hear me now. Hear me now by the Spirit of God. Hear me now by the Spirit of God. Hear me now by the Spirit of God. You are going to pray that whatever altar that your name has been mentioned, whatever altar that the enemy has set up, witches and wizards have put together to destroy you, you are going to say that those altars be destroyed. You are going to say, Father, let my name be erased from that altar. Let my name be removed from that altar. Let my picture disappear from that altar. Let whatever enchantment that was released against me, let that altar be pulled down in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Are you listening to me? Yes. yes. I can, can you, are you sure you can hear me? Yes. 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 I want you to lift up your voice. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, Father in, the in the name, name of, of Jesus. Jesus. Whatever altar. Whatever altar. My name has been mentioned. My name has been mentioned. My family has been mentioned. My family has been mentioned. My bloodline has been mentioned. My bloodline has been mentioned. Every assignment of the devil upon that altar. Every assignment of the devil upon that altar. I cancel it now. I cancel it now. I destroy it now. I destroy it now. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. In the name 
name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, by the power of the Holy Spirit, by the power of the Holy Spirit, today let my picture disappear. Today let my picture disappear. Let my name disappear from that altar. Let my name disappear from that altar. Those who are connected to me be delivered from that altar. Those who are connected to me be delivered from that altar. In the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, let every satanic altar begin to crumble. Let every satanic altar begin to crumble. Open your mouth, begin to cancel it now. Let it be Destroyed. 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 be destroyed. Palia, 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 as corporate prayer, this is our last prayer point. You are going to pray that those who have been holding your destiny partners. Mm. Amen. You see, sometimes the devil knows who is supposed to come and be a blessing in your life. And when the devil knows this, he will keep them hindered so that you don't receive what God needs for wow. you. Wow. 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 So you are going to pray that, Father, all my destiny helpers, wherever they are, I give them breakthroughs so that they can join what I am doing for you. Amen. Amen. Are you listening to me? Yes. Are you ready to pray? Are you ready to pray? Yes. Ready. Are you ready to pray? Yes. Are you ready to pray? Yes. 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 Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus. All my destiny helpers. All my destiny helpers. No matter where they're located. No matter where they're located. I open their doors. I open their doors. I release the blessing of God upon them. I release the blessing of God upon them. Let them be strengthened. Let them be strengthened. And come and join what you have given me to do. And come and join what you have given me to do. That whatever we will do. That whatever we will do. It will be unto your glory. It will be unto your glory. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Open your mouth, begin to pray. Rigadoba. Zakala mandele bele bele be suta. Every demonic torment. Every demonic torment. Every demonic torment. I destroy I Every Korea Madigadosh Korea Madigadosh Korea Madigadosh Korea Madigadosh Korea Madigadosh Korea Madigadosh In Jesus name In Jesus name The Holy Spirit actually just told me to add one prayer point Hallelujah Amen this one is for divine protection for families. Oh, Amen. Amen. Yes. Divine protection for your family. Hallelujah. 
Are you still here? If you're here, just type, I am here. I am, I am here. here. If you're here, just type, I am here. I am, I am here. here. If you're here, just type, I am here. I am here. We are going to pray for divine protection. Amen. Amen. You see, this time of the year when the year is about to close, a lot of mysterious and strange things begin to happen. Mm-hmm. Are you listening to me? Yes. yes. Mysterious and strange things begin to happen. People die untimely. Mm-hmm. Yes. Accidents happen. Yeah. Strange things happen. Yes. We are going to pray for divine protection for our families. Amen. 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 That December 31st will not find us in the grave. Amen. 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 That our families will not perish until what God has called us to do is fulfilled. Yes. Amen. 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 Are you ready to pray? Yes. 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 If you're ready, just tap, I am ready. I am ready. I am ready. 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 If you're ready, just tap, I am ready. I am am ready. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Oh, Father, you are worthy of all praise. Father, you are worthy of all praise. Father, you are worthy of all praise. Father, you are worthy of all praise and adoration. Only your name should be lifted up. No other name but your name. Yes, Lord. Glory be to Jesus. Listen to me now. Say, Father, in the name of Jesus. Father, Father in, in the, the name, name of, of Jesus. Jesus. I secure my family. I secure, I secure my, my family. family. All those who are connected to me. All, All those who are connected, connected to me. I secure them now. I, I secure them, them now. In the name of Jesus. In the, in the name, name of, of Jesus. May your angels surround them. May your, may angels, angels, surround them. Surround them. May your angels keep them. May, may your, your angels, angels keep them. them. That they will not be caught in the trap of the enemy. That, that they, they will not be be caught, caught in, in the, the trap, trap of the enemy. That none of them should die immaturely. That none, none of them should die prematurely. None of them should die prematurely. None of them should die prematurely. No snare of the enemy will overtake them. No, no snare, snare of the, of the enemy, enemy will overtake, overtake them. Today we secure our children. Today we secure our children. We secure our husbands, our wives. We secure our husbands, our wives. In the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Lift up your voice begin to pray Secure our families, our children, all those who are connected to us, they are secure. We secure them in the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Let them be secure. Let them be secure. No sickness will overtake them. Premature death will not overtake them. Every premature death I cast in, in the name of Jesus. In the name of Jesus. Jesus. No accidents upon the road. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. God is good. Listen to me, children of God. The Lord loves you. May the Lord keep you. May the Lord bless you. I release the blessing of God over you. I can't wait for God to elevate you beginning this moment. And I am looking forward to each and every testimony that you carry within you in the name of Jesus. May the Lord bless you until tomorrow. Shalom.
divine In that moment our souls entwine Time stood still, a you flew by Fate conspired under the sky I wove my charm, a tender thread Into the tapestry of love we spread For all those years through joy and pain We danced in sunshine, kissed in rain You anchor me With you I'm free A whisper at night With you I take flight You're my rock in the restless tide In your love I find my pride You take my wild and set me free In your eyes my destiny You anchor me With you I'm free A whisper at night With you I take flight You call me With you I'm at ease A guiding light With you I'm right no quarrels darken our shared skies And in the smokes where wisdom lies You're my mirror, my closest friend In your heart I find no end You anchor me With you I'm free A whisper at night With you I take flight You call me With you I'm at ease A guiding light With you I'm right Glow together like stars in the night. In your love, I found my light.